Welcome back to Walls of Day. Where Walls of Day is Juggler, a 1982 release running here on the Apple II Plus in Open Emulator. I don't usually use uh, Open Emulator, so this might look a little different. I'm going to press Return to start, but what I'm really going to do, I'm going to press Control i to access the secret hidden menu where you can see all the options. Uh, so you can see we've got Auto Toss, we've got Begin New Game, Control i for this information, we've got Keyboard and Pedal Mode, I'm going to use Keyboard Mode. Uh, if you have watched some other uh, videos in the series, you know I have some trouble with paddle controls sometimes. Uh, you can toggle the sound, you can pause the action with escape, and you got left and right to move your juggle left and right. Uh, you got 30 times level per hit for your uh, points, and you get bonus points while you're in the maze and shoot. You get 500 bonus points if the juggler tosses tumblers directly. Your object is to keep all tumblers off ground. Let's get into it here. Juggler. I'm going to start off on level one. Let's start juggling. That's our juggler there. Uh, they're, they're shooting these things out of their hands constantly. This is the auto toss, I believe. That uh, keeps these things in the air. That's how juggling works. You can get some bonus points if we uh, hit directly instead of using those. But let's start on easy mode. Get a feel for juggler. This is the usual uh, keyboard control problem of you do have to hit the opposite direction to stop going the direction that you started going in. Yeah, this won't run on a. Oh no, I, I dropped a ball. This won't run on an Apple IIe or any, anything later than Apple II Plus because of the copy protection. And the copy protection also seems to have a, a trouble in. Uh, and virtual too. Mame Mame seems to run this fine, but uh, I want to I want to give him Open Emulator a shot. I can't really use Open Emulator for games where I need a joystick or paddle because I can't get the get the mapping to work yet. Oh, I think we're on to level two here. Now the real juggler begins. I'm curious how how crazy it gets at level seven. I figure we can. See how far we get here on my first try juggling. Maybe we'll jump up a little bit and see. I think I got a bonus there. Or juggling uh, directly. And the other way you can uh, ramp up the difficulty is turning off that uh, auto toss. Let's see how that goes for us. Yeah, but since this, since this works in MAME, you should be able to play this in browser. With keyboard controls if you want to. Trying to keep all these balls in the air. Oh no. Down to our last uh, juggler, it looks like. Do I have any more in reserve? Wait, why did the uh, pieces change shape if we didn't change levels? Ah. Maybe maybe every death they change, change shape. Seems a little cruel to execute the juggler if they, they drop a ball, but those are the rules. Oh wait, are we, go are we still going? Okay, no. Okay, this is the restart. Uh, let's press return. You want to jump to level 3 or 4? Let's, let's go 4. Let's see how crazy it gets. Then we'll jump to level 7. Then maybe we'll uh, go back to level 1 and turn off auto juggle. Oh no, I was so busy trying to trying to lock them in there that I ignored the, the other balls falling to the ground. Yeah, it seems like it changes every time you die. So do we get more points if they're bouncing over on the right and the left here? Is that the deal? What it was telling us on the information screen? Definitely one of those simple but hard games. I'm not sure why they wanted to do physics simulation on the Apple II. It's not really its uh, strong suit. It doesn't have a dedicated uh, physical coprocessor. 
the physics coprocessor, as it were. Oh, I think we got a bonus for that. Oh no. It is easier to rack up a higher score on these uh, levels because uh, it's 30 times the level number. So let's try sub and see how crazy it gets here. Maybe we'll drop it back after this and try Oh man, look at our, our auto juggle is pathetic now. So we'll see how this goes. See if we're gonna set a new. Oh no. Set a new high score. I don't know if it's gonna happen here on level 7. Gotta kind of corral the balls together so you can manage them, otherwise you're gonna have a bad time. Oh, just barely got it. Yeah. That's not it. We might, we might, let's see. We might, we might pass our high score, moment of truth. Famous last words. You can also, uh, in some cases, it seems like get the physics to uh, get stuck in a loop sometimes. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I'll be able to show that here. I did, when I was testing it out, I got uh, some of the balls stuck so that they were just kind of like constantly bouncing without me having to juggle them. But uh, got a new high score of 25,040, I think. I don't know if it reflects until we start over again. Let's see. Two, one. Yeah, it does. Okay, so let's hit control A. Then you get space to juggle. So let's see how this goes. Iron Man mode uh, here on Juggler. It does make it easier to get the bonus points if you want. But that's the kind of life you're living. Going for Juggler high scores. Oh no. I, I went left when I should have gone right. Classic uh, Juggler mistake. The one thing you don't want to do when you're juggling. Rack up those bonuses. Nice. Oh no! There's, there's a danger in the bonuses too. As you can see. It's a very different game between auto juggle and manual juggle. You're hitting space here. Just send them out on uh, manual juggling. Ah! What do you want to try? You want to try? Let's see. I'm curious also if it persists the auto juggle setting. Or if we're gonna have to do it again. Yeah, yeah, it seems to persist it. This is level 7. That's manual juggling, let's see. Oh no, <laughs> it's going terribly for me now. It is much harder without the auto juggle. I don't know what what else you would expect, but I gotta try it out to know. It seems odd that the regular bounces are multiplied, but not your bonus bounce. Maybe let's try to get a bonus bounce here on. Oh no, but yeah, I think I think that's gonna do it here for me with uh, Juggler for Waza Day, and if you like early arcade-style games for the Apple II like this, then go ahead and subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow for our next Waza Day.